is going on YouTube it is Ty here back with another video today is a little different um, as you can see by the title it's a little different we're doing a vlog today we are checking out the gun show and uh, if you have not already though before I get into everything if you have not already go ahead and subscribe to the channel I have more gun content on the way for you guys and uh, I figured I'd switch it up today and do something a little different so if you like gun content subscribe to the channel like the video if you like the content I'm gonna try to be putting out more but here we are so we're here at the KCI Expo Center if you can see it it's over there and uh, yeah we're gonna check out see what they got here we're gonna check out what some of the we're just gonna see what they have all right see everybody here we are the gun show. got some ammo there's a lot of there's a lot of people here check it out man there's so many guns here it's so dope tell me what does everybody think about the uh what h and k think about h and k there's so many there's so many so much stuff here so many toys to look at and play with it's crazy all right so i'm over here at this table right here and it just reminded me to ask the question like what do y'all think about shotguns so there's like a few as you can see it's like a few different shotguns what do y'all think about shotguns like i know i haven't really talked too much about shotguns but what does everybody think about shotguns i, I just kind of want to know what your guys take is on that all right so what do you guys think about like 22 like i've been thinking about a 22 but I know this, this, I always see this M&P, so I always wonder what uh, everybody thinks about 22. <laughs> I ain't seen one in a long time. There's so much stuff. PSA. PSA though, got the PSA on there. So this lady was just telling us about the world's largest gun show, uh, one of them being in Tulsa, Oklahoma, and uh, it sounds dope. So I might have to go. Eventually I'm gonna get into some rifles, some long rifles right here. As you can see, I haven't found anything that I feel like I need, but you can always find something, but I haven't found anything yet, so still just kind of checking things out, seeing what everybody has. Who knows though, maybe something to catch my eye. What about another AR? Maybe another AR, we'll see. Got so many here, so many to choose from. Ideally though, probably for my next one, I'd probably want to do like a 14.5. I think 14.5 is a solid length. I'm stuck in between like a 14.5 or something shorter. What in the world? Yeah. All right, so the best home defense weapon right here. Ready? And in this whole, out of this whole building, it's right here. A slingshot. What y'all think about that? What y'all think about a slingshot? Nah, I'm just kidding. I'm not real big into knives right now, but I really would like to, but I think there's some pretty dope knives that a lot of people would like that I think I would like too. Like, there's a lot, there's a lot, a lot going on. Pulled 1150 on the 300 blackout. Okay. And I got 1500 on that one. All right. This is what we need right here. That's 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 ideal right there. That's what we might need right there. Five, five, six with a wood grip on it, wood handguard, 
you have a flash can on, adapter pack for stock, compass and turn, and screen set. 16 inch girl. It looks different. It looks like an AR, it looks like an AK. That's why I built it. I had four of them yesterday, two more. That's why I got lucky at last one. Looks like an AK, the wood feels good. Yeah, it's really nice. Yeah, it's really nice. Spikes type too, so. Yeah. Oh, you know what? It, it doesn't say I'm going to take it out for another trigger in it. I got one that shoots a lot faster. No scope on it, it's going to have none. Oh, yeah. It's going out. Yeah, yeah, for sure, man. I don't know me, I'm a, I'm a subcompact guy, and this is very tempting right now. We're looking at the... We got the Tor... We got the Taurus... We got the Taurus G2C, and then we got the Ruger Max 9. And I'm definitely torn in between which ones I want. So, I don't know. Well, I don't know if I want to pull the trigger on something, but I, s I have my eyes on a few things. Not sure if I'm going to get anything, but, you know, there's a lot to look at and a lot to think about. Kind of give me some ideas as far as, like, what I want to do for my next purchase or build. So, we'll see. A brand that I kind of really want to check out is CZ. Man, I think they make some pretty dope guns. Like, that is dope to me. That's pretty sick. A nice CZ. SP01 is nice. It just feels nice and it's quality. It just feels really quality. Well, guys. Took a little tour, checked it out. We went there, did that. Um, so I actually didn't end up. Shocker! I actually didn't end up, didn't end up getting anything. Uh, there was some stuff in there I liked and all, but I'll talk more about that later. There were a lot of people out there, and uh, I think it was a really fun thing to do and a cool experience, getting to see all the guns and stuff like that. Um, however. I did see some things that I did like and things that I disliked, but it really had me thinking like, I don't know, it was pretty cool because um, I just got to see everybody's stuff and uh, I was talking with one guy and it was kind of had me thinking like as far as like doing another build or something. So um, I kind of just really, yeah, it just had me thinking that a build would be probably cool and uh, you know instead of buying like something complete but there's nothing wrong with complete but it just had me thinking that a build like building out part by part you know why like thinking like why i chose you know specific parts and stuff like that and just kind of just think through the whole process as far as like what the purpose is so who knows maybe i'll have a video of like explaining like some some of the reasonings or why or why not you should build or buy complete but with that being said, if you stuck around this long and you checked out the, vl the vlog and you like this type of style of video, uh, leave a like, a comment, um, anything helps the channel. Uh, but that's all I have for you guys. It's your boy Ty and I am out of here. Peace.